Now, if you have patients that you have presented treatment to and they did not move forward with oral appliance therapy for one reason or another, maybe it was because of insurance coverage, maybe it was maybe your fee for service and they weren't comfortable paying that much. There, there's a number of reasons that people aren't moving forward with treatment. But with the new year, there's a huge, huge opportunity for you because you can actually reach out to those patients, reconnect, and you can actually develop a conversation around dental sleep, not specifically dental sleep though. Okay. You're not, pu you're not just pushing appliances. You want to help people uh, have a better lifestyle, not just get better sleep, not just stop snoring. You want them to be healthy. And that's the opportunity you have is to create conversations around that, around their health. The new year, everybody's focused on health. Everybody. Okay. They want to be, they, you know, new year, new me, all this, all those cliche sayings, but you have a huge opportunity to create those conversations and help those people achieve those goals. So what you're going to want to do come new year, you're going to start reaching out to those people who you've had conversations with previously saying, Hey, I just wanted to check in with you. Last time we talked, you know, you said you, you weren't really, you, you didn't use your CPAP that often, but you were going to try and be more consistent. How's that been? Oh, you haven't been wearing that that often. How is it? Well, how has your sleep been? You can start going down the line and what you want to do, don't focus on getting them into a sleep appliance or accepting treatment. Focus on their health and how they're doing and get them to focus on how their life has been affected by not getting proper sleep and not breathing properly.